yeah, homeware furniture and like there there are clothes, but they're more, like it's a very different aesthetic from mm. the ZS Draper right now. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, but it's really new the baby, so we're trying to build it into hopefully something that's also more like um, just more environmentally conscious a little bit. So yeah. everything's produced really slow, small batches, mostly hand, like all hand done. So yeah, that's the focus for Jahan. Yeah, well, yeah. do you think um, I was interested uh, in in asking about those aspects also? Yejo, like yeah. Is that taking any wider acceptance across the industry that you see being more environmentally conscious? Is this something people also want? Is it just something you can see a designer and agar soch liya, to ho gaya? Warna, it's yeah. not really a trend in Pakistan. In Pakistan, I would say that very few brands are genuinely interested in engaging with that question. Yeah. Internationally also let's be honest yes I know a lot of people a lot of brands now publish like their impact reports and all of that but actual action bahut yeah. kam hai. Yeah. And that's unfortunate because fashion in international globally is a very extremely unregulated industry we know that it is Pakistan mein to bhool jao there is no regulation. Right. There is that's it. So there's no compulsion for brands to necessarily engage with that. I genuinely don't think we're in a place where a lot of the customers care. They don't. There's a very small group that cares very, very passionately. But that small group is not going to ultimately affect the choices that brands make. It's very unfortunate. I'm not right. at all like saying that this is okay. But <laughs> I'm saying this is the unfortunate reality of yeah, yeah. Pakistan. But... There are certain people like I. I care. I deeply care about fashion just changing radically. Like I think the entire industry needs to be taken apart, rebuilt, like any other industry. Let's be honest. Everything needs to be rebuilt, rebuilt and regulated heavily, like heavily, very strictly regulated. With regard, but to in the current it. system, these worker conditions can affect you. May just steel per production, or the just waste disposal, any of these things. Up. Mostly cheese and Joel Lahore ke brands bana rahe um, The industrial area is right there. It's right behind Model Town, right? So you can actually go and see the industrial area and you can see ke, kya halat kya hai pe, right? Hmm. Um, so just simple things, simple, simple regulations. Not, but ye cheese and kene mein simple hoti hai, obviously karne mein, yeah. like I said, everything will have to be taken apart and then rebuilt. Do you think there's any expectation or hope that this will happen? There is no hope. Matlab, there's always hope that capitalism will die a swift death at some point. Of course, right. there's always the hope. <laughs> high political are really, yeah. yeah. You know, this is why it's even more strange that I work in fashion, but I, yeah. I do. Um, so there's always hope. Of course, there's hope. And I was just going to say, in the meantime, there are a few people in the industry, like me, like Omar, like Iman, for instance, um, there's a few of us who do have these conversations constantly. We do have th- these conversations with our clients. We have it with other creatives. We have it with each other. It's not enough. It's yeah. not. But um, at the end of the day, we don't control means of production. We don't benefit massively from it. We're also workers. workers. That's it. But if I think you, if you speak to your clients enough, if you speak to designers enough, now, like I, I was speaking about Jahan before earlier, Jahan is, I, I believe, ZSJ trying to move in a different direction. Yeah. You know, create something that's a little more kind to yeah. the environment. Also, perhaps so, if, it, if it's included in like, you know, marketing material or whatever, it can sort of become this aspirational attribute ke for people to consciously because like at the end of the day if you want people to spend their money in more responsible areas there has to be some sort of innate um attraction absolutely. there absolutely for sure and that's something when so umar and i work on jahan also when we're shooting for jahan or when we're thinking of campaigns for jahan we're thinking very differently hmm. we are trying to create like images that not in an obvious in your face way, say, please recycle, please. No, it's not like that. But we are trying to 
create images that maybe encourage people to buy less, you mm -hmm. know, in some way. Um, or just, yeah, simplify their consumer habits, buy less, be more responsible, be more conscious of where things are coming from. Um, we're trying to be very transparent in how honest we are about how something is made. So honestly, you have to show people that something can be done better for them right. to start asking industry-wide for things to be done better. Mm. That's what I personally believe. Yeah.